Good morning, you guys. Hope your morning is off to a good start, or if you're watching this later in the day, I hope you're having a great day. As you guys can see, this morning's chat's coming from my uh, my basement gym. So I just got done with a workout and that's what gave me kind of some inspiration for what to chat about today. So these are new. Um, if you're watching this, depending on where you are, this is one of the first ones that I've done. So I'm going to be vlogging, um, five minute little chit chats, um, to talk about just training topics or like life things and just really kind of hoping to be an accountability partner, um, and hoping that you guys will be accountability partners for me by interacting with these videos. And um, I'm always looking for ideas, so if there's something that you wanna talk about, let me know. Um, but basically, I, I realized something about myself. I know something about myself. I can't even start a day without coffee, so there's that. I actually don't even have coffee today, I have tea. Um, Cause we're out. But um, I, thought, I thought of this while I was working out. I just did like a half an hour workout, which is normally, I would never do that. Um, I am the kind of person that again, being a perfectionist, everything has to be perfect and I'm not gonna work out unless it's like 100%. Like I need a full hour and it needs to be like a CrossFit style workout. I basically need to murder myself or it was worthless. That kind of mentality, which is super, super dangerous. So I don't know if you've ever felt like that, maybe about work or about working out, for example, but um, I, yeah, I just feel like that affects me. Um, so I want to talk about that and how it affects us in business and our, like our personal lives. But um, really, one of the things that I'm gonna try to do, and I, I'm gonna encourage you guys to do this too, is maybe your issue is not working out. Maybe it's something else. I'm just gonna use working out as an example. I'm going to try really hard to commit to 20 minutes of heavy exercise um, every day. See, I'm kind of doing it again. Like it doesn't have to be heavy exercise, just 20 minutes of exercise every day. Because what's happened to me lately is um, I have not made the time, and it's not that I don't have the time, but I haven't made the time to commit that full hour to my, my workout. I have no excuse because this whole gym is in my basement. You guys can't see it, but I have like a rower, a bike, everything that I need. Um, but like I haven't been doing it. And the reason I realized is I, um, it's not perfect. It's never perfect. Every day lately something has been happening that I just can't, I can't get that perfect workout in. So what I'm gonna do is every day, 20 minutes, seven days a week, because it's only 20 minutes, seven days a week of exercise. Um, what this is gonna do for me, and I think would do for you if you tried it, is just creating habits so that exercise becomes something that you do um, no matter what. Um, and it's just like something you'd be like, oh wow, I didn't ha like I didn't have my morning coffee today. Oh wow, I didn't do my coffee or I didn't do my workout today. That I feel off. So and then beyond that, 20 minutes times seven. I'm not a mathematician, but I think that's 140 minutes, which is like two hours. So it's two hours of exercise. And to be honest, last week I didn't exercise at all, which um, is not like me. And it's again back to trying to be a perfectionist. So. This way, I feel like I'm gonna get at least two hours of exercise in a week, which I don't like how that sounds. I would like it to be more, but this is just um, a minimum. And then, you know, if you feel like doing more, go ahead and do more. But uh, what I want you to take that and apply it to your life, if, if exercise isn't really relevant to you right now, is maybe like try um, and commit to doing that one thing that you haven't done yet. I see this a lot with permanent makeup artists and new business owners. It's like, for example, their website. There's this one thing that they need to do that's kind of hard. Usually it's not that complex, it's kind of simple, but it's like time consuming and it makes them uncomfortable. So I want you to think of what that one thing is. I guarantee you there is something. Um, and then take 20 minutes every day this week, every single day, and work on it. It doesn't have to be perfect. So like for example, let's say it's your website, you don't have to get it done today. You just need to spend 20 minutes getting closer to getting it done. Um, it could be 20 minutes of nonsense because you got interrupted 30 times so it really was five minutes, but it literally needs to be 20 minutes where you're attempting to focus 100% on that one thing that you keep putting off. And then, I mean, hell, if you do this for a week, you've made a lot of progress. Maybe you'll get it done, but also it'll be a rhythm for you um, and it's progress um, towards making a habit. So that's what's most important. So I would love to hear from you guys if this works for you, whether it's with exercise or um, with your business or something that you need to do at work. Um, and then like comment and let me know like what you're working on. What are your 20 minutes going toward? I would love to hear from you guys and then kind of learn what you're doing. So 
anyway, I hope you guys, you guys have a great day. I will see you tomorrow. Um, yeah, and you guys go kill it today. I'm gonna do my best. Bye.